topic of the kingdom. And as far as the Son of David title is concerned, that shows us there is now a kingdom and there is now a reigning king rather than completely future. From Jomar Manguera, Jomes of CLC Pateros. Does Luke 1720 support a millennialism? Well, I'm not going into that, uh, even if I uh, have a side swipe, so to speak, of that issue. But uh, Luke 1720, when Jesus said that the kingdom is in the midst of you, now you see the problem of interpretation by many is some translation as the kingdom is within you. And so it gives the idea that the kingdom is in the heart. It is the pietistic interpretation of the kingdom. What Jesus is saying is, if this is done through the Holy Spirit, then the kingdom is coming in your midst. Already in your midst in the person of Jesus and will become a formality at the resurrection of Jesus. Jesus is the embodiment of the kingdom. So during his earthly ministry, he could claim that the kingdom is in the midst of you because he is the embodiment of that kingdom. But the kingdom began its formality as a realm under the reign of the one ruling at the resurrection. That's when Peter says on Pentecost, Jesus sat on the throne of his father, David. <clears throat> Other questions? <clears throat> 